Your favorite radio station. This is Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Hey guys, we're still here at Playhouse for Afro Basil's event, and we have one of the lovely guests. As I've seen at the first portion of Afro Basil, what brought you back again tonight? Um, I hope to come to all of them, and I just love like the energy and everything, the, the culture and all the people, the good energy like mixed together. It's just a great experience. What's different about tonight compared to the first Afro Basil event that you went to? Um, I see a lot of new art and some amazing art actually uh, a lot more than last time but um, last time there was like um, like physical things that you could like actually go into like the ball pit and stuff and this is more of a visual thing and so I think that's different and like there's music and stuff like people performing and I just think it's a great experience everything is wonderful amazing well thank you so much for telling us about your experience you guys heard it here with Afro Vibes Radio Houston all right guys the event has finally come to an end. It's been such an amazing night. We have one of the last co-founders of Afro Basil, Mr. Haven Mozart himself. If you guys have been tuning in and watching this, you know he's been hyped up and turned up all night long. How you feeling, my brother? I'm feeling very nice that you're here, Tequila. Ah, uh, you always say that. Thank you. So how did, this, how did tonight go for you guys? Really well, really well. It was raining, but everybody still came. And you're here. I feel great now. You are our best. So, so far tonight you had a lot of art, you had performances, you had uh, live art actually. It was so many great things going on, especially with you emceeing and hosting. Do you feel like tonight's event came together as you wanted to on a cultural aspect? Uh, um, no. I feel like there's a lot more opportunity, there's a lot more work I have to do. Uh, but I use this as a learning lesson. This wasn't a flop. This was amazing, but there's more work I have to do. Houston, Texas, America, you got to feel Afro, anything Afro. And my job is to bring that to you in a new vibe, in a new curation. And that's what my job is to do with Afro Basil. So America, get ready. World, we're coming for you. That's right. We got Afro sauce. We got Afro Basil. We got everything Afro coming for you. That's right. We're a lot and we got it. That's right. You guys heard it right here from himself. Please be sure to check out Afro Basil happening every month right here in Houston. Check out Afro Vibes Radio Houston. That's right, Tequila. That's right. There with Afro Vibes Radio at Playhouse for Afro Basil's event. And we have Audrey, is it correct, right? Yes, you know how I know that? Because I follow her on Instagram. <laughs> she has some amazing artwork, and tonight she will be displaying it. Tell us a little bit about what you have set up. Um, so what I have set up is just kind of a mixture of me. Um, when you see my paintings, you can kind of tell who I am, you know, as an individual, what I like, and my style. So um, when people see my art, they know it's me because I have my own unique to it. So um, I love coming to events and showing off my style. Um, this tribal African woman empowerment, earthy colors, just really good vibes. So um, I love it. Yeah, absolutely. So what made you want to be a part of Afro Basil tonight? Um, Afro Basil is all about the culture. It's all about one night of just celebrating who we are and what we love and um, our culture. So a lot of my art is all African art. Um, I do a lot of masks, I do a lot of tribal stuff, so I fit right in when it comes to this event and um, everybody loves my stuff and they're blown away. So my art definitely is a good place, this is a good place to be for my art. Before you get out of here, just give them your social media and website so they can actually purchase some of your artwork and learn about you. Yeah, absolutely. So I do have a website. It's artbyaudrey.com. And my Instagram is Miss Audrey, M-I-S-S underscore A-U-D-R-I-I-I. You heard it here first with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Hey, Grace. What's Hi. up? Why, how, what are you doing at this event tonight? Um, I actually just stumbled in here. I don't know where I am. No, I'm a comedian and I came here to do comedy and yes. She just did an amazing impression of Obama. And you too. <laughs> and no, not on me. Uh, thank you very much and uh, as my uh, fellow American, I would uh, love if uh, she would promote me more, but uh, it's not happening. So. I, l I love Obama. Um. <laughs> Viva Obama forever. <laughs> what do you look forward to happening the rest of this night? Uh, I'm, I'm ready to get some liquid libations. Okay, I'm ready to get soft. You understand? I, I, I you see understand. the look in my eye? Yeah, Does it, there's nothing indicated from that. But no, I'm, I'm, I'm ready to like have fun, meet people, network, look at the art. I need something for my room because my room bail right now. 
Well. Well, I'm sure you'll have a lot to see tonight. I will. Okay. Hey, Jordan. Hey, what's up? How's your night been going? Great. Fabulous. What Love have you been place. doing? Who are you here with? What are you wearing? <laughs> I was here for my friend Grace um, okay. to see her uh, comedy skit. Mm -hmm. It's great. I'm wearing, <laughs> who knows? <laughs> uh, and it's been great. Like a lot of good art. Like such good art. This one is really fire. Have you been getting your groove on tonight? I sure have. Yeah. I've been having a blast, you know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, what do you look forward to the rest of the night? Um, honestly, the rest of the talent, excited to see what everybody's got to show, you know. Alright, well thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey guys, this is the Queen of Afro Vibes Radio. We have another guest. Please introduce yourself. My name is Shalisa, also known as She RC. What brings you out tonight to the event? What was that? What brings you out to the event tonight? Um, I was invited by Heaven and I have a lot of African inspired art, so I was here tonight for that reason. And what are you enjoying the most about tonight? Um, the networking aspect. I met a lot of amazing people and, you know, just feeling the vibes out of the night. Amazing. What's your social media? Uh, it's she RC is S A D I A R T B Y. Amazing. You look good, girl. I love your outfit. You look real cute, styling and profiling. Right here at Afro Basil at Playhouse with Afro Vibes Radio. <laughs> How are you enjoying Afro Basil? Man, it's a vibe out here, for real. Like, first off, the art is amazing, and the performers are wonderful, too. Like, as you can hear in the background, they jamming in there. So, hey, it's a lit scene, for real. Cool. And is this your first Afro Basil? Actually, yes. Yes, it is. It's and what, what, what brings you to this one? Um, well, I got a. Uh, artist here with me by the name of Skyra Bliss. Shout out to Skyra Bliss over here to my right. Um, I'm here to support her and, uh, you know, just be there like good label mate should and she knows she's busy right now doing her thing. But yeah, here to support Skyra and also check out this wonderful art. It's beautiful out here. Okay. And what do you look forward to for the rest of the night? I look forward to just continuing to catch a vibe, for real. Like, I'm all about catching vibes out here, man. I love the energy in here. I love the people in here. Gotten to, you know, impromptu dance a little bit with some of the people out here. So, like, it's just, it's fun, man. I'm just here to catch a vibe for the rest of the night. I'm loving it. All right, well, thank you for your interview. <laughs> hey, uh, what is your name? Bree, but I go by the B Marie. So on uh, Instagram, at the B Marie underscore. Okay, Bree. And what are you doing here tonight at Afro Basil? After? Oh. Afro Basil. So I am showcasing my art. I do only have three pieces tonight. Um, I didn't want to bring out too much. I do have a bigger piece. I think it's 46 by 36. Um, that's back there um, in the back room. And then I have two smaller pieces on the staircase as well. So. Okay, so you're here for some art. Yes. Some, some showing and some scene. Yes. Alright, and um, what are you, how do you feel about being at this event, like what it has, what it can offer? I am very excited to be here because it's so many artists in one space, that's always a beautiful thing, you know, um, to network with everybody, even if, if, even if I don't sell anything tonight, it's still a very uh, great networking opportunity for me, so I'm excited. And it's a beautiful community. Too. It is a beautiful community. Um, there's no hate. There's no really competition. It's more of empowerment. So I love it. I love being a part of this community. All right. And how do? What do you look forward to for the rest of the night? So I'm gonna chill out here. I'm looking forward to my pieces being sold. So okay. we're gonna put that in the atmosphere. Into the universe. Yes. Um, afterwards, I'm going out. So yesterday was my birthday. So oh, happy birthday. Yes, thank you. <laughs> So yeah, I'm just excited to meet all the artists, meet all the people that are here um, to join us and yeah, go out afterwards and have fun. Right. <laughs> well, thank you for interviewing and thank you for being here tonight. Thank you. Hey guys, you're still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio and we have two lovely ladies with us. How are y'all doing tonight? I'm well, I'm well. And you? I'm well, thank you for asking. So what has been the highlight of Afro Basil for you? 
Wow. The highlight, honestly, has been the great, incredible art here. Honestly, there's a lot of talented artists. Um, there's a lot of dancers, performers, singers, musicians. It's honestly incredible. And what about you? What has been the highlight for tonight? Definitely it would be the African-American community to see us all come together, especially first-generation Africans. This is amazing. I've never seen anything like this. Amazing. And so are you going to look forward to many more afro Basel events? Because I know they just had one recently and they're having another one and it's just getting better and better. Why, yeah, of course. This is on a very top tier scale. So, of course, yeah, I'm coming to the next one. Absolutely. Well, you guys look lovely. Thank you so much. You guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Hey, guys, so we have another lovely guest tonight. Please introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Dedo. That is D-E-D-O. So, I know you probably got some African background. Tell us about your culture. Yes, um, I have African ancestry. Um, I don't know my roots just yet, but it's always great to be able to vibe with my African family. Um, I'm Hispanic as well. My father is Colombian, so I have a mixture of the African culture and the Hispanic culture combined. So, it's the best of both worlds. <laughs> well, you are so beautiful, by the way. And so how do you feel being at Afro Basil tonight? I know it's just filled with so much African art and culture and music. It is really great. It's a great synergy in here, and it's just great to see all my friends doing their thing. Luckily, I was able to be a part of the show. I'm one of the models for the display in the front. So it's just it's really great. It's a great vibe. <laughs> so what do you like the most about Afro Basil? I love the energy, just everybody being so happy and lively and just us all coming together. Houston doesn't really have so many events where people are like creatives can just come together and like be love and spread love. So it's a great vibe. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, again, you look beautiful tonight. You vibe with the essence of the room and I hope you have a remaining night. Just wonderful uh, times. And you guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibe. Okay. Hi, hello. Welcome. You can't hear nothing we're saying at all. But hey, you looking gorgeous. Can you show them your purse and flip your hair for me real quickly? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. You see that wasn't hard. Hey guys, you're tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio. Please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Awune Wane. You can find me on Instagram, just underscore woo underscore. My name is Dexter. <laughs> okay, well, y'all looking very lovely tonight, very beautiful and handsome. So, what are y'all enjoying about Afro Basil tonight? Oh, the energy. The moment you come in, you can just feel the vibes coming up. Everyone and the art is so beautiful, and the ambiance is amazing. And what about you? I just love, you know, it's so much art, and so much culture, and there's so much exposure into something that's different. I just love it. Do you feel like an event like this is needed for the culture? Absolutely. You know, with the wave of everyone going back to their roots, it's important that we show them the beauty of it. Like, Africa hasn't been shown all the beauty that it has, but events like this can really bring people in and allow them to get to know all it is about them in a comfortable atmosphere. And what about you? Absolutely. I mean, I 100% agree with her. You know, I just think it, it brings so much exposure, you know, and it brings so much awareness that people didn't know before, you know. It's amazing. Well, thank you guys so much for your time. You both look beautiful, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. You guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. All right, you are looking absolutely amazing tonight. I'm loving the hair, the outfit, the shoes. You got it going on. How are you enjoying Afro Basil tonight? I'm really enjoying it. To get to see all the black art on display is really something special. I really, I really like it. Okay, so what is your favorite part about tonight? The music, like I feel like when I walked in, it just was like boom, you know, like the energy that's in the room just up and down. You got us turned up right now, y'all, in the middle of the interview. This should show you how turned up Afro Basil is and why you need to be here, right? What I'm talking about. Like, <laughs> well, you look absolutely amazing. I think that whole moment just spoke for itself. Before you got here, what's your social media? Uh, my social media is Ragashanti, R-A-G-G-A-C-H-A-N-T-I on Instagram. Follow me. 
Make sure you guys follow her and stay guys. We're here with Afro Vibes Radio and we're still at Afro Basil's event. It's getting ready to wind down, but we have just one more guest tonight. Please introduce yourself. Hey, how y'all doing? My name is Brandon. Nice to meet everybody out there. I hope everybody's doing good. Everybody in the city showing love. Shout out to everybody in Houston. Everybody all over the globe showing love from down south, Philly, New York, all back the way, Africa, Senegal, Morocco, Mauritania, everybody showing love. Nigeria, showing love to everybody. Y'all keep doing what y'all doing out there. I see y'all. This guy is crazy, yo, but look, what brings you out tonight for Afro Basil's event? Oh, man, just hey, came through to show love to my people, man. Everybody's coming through showing love, good vibes, good music, good people like yourself. You're showing love, everybody styling, profiling. I see you out here. You know I had to come through and be one with my people, man. Show love. You know, the ancestors would be proud right now if they saw us out here with unison, you know. So I got to keep that going, you know. Everybody show love. Everybody show respect. We come together as one. Ain't nothing we can't get done. You know what I mean? So he's going to keep going. Absolutely. I'm digging your vibe, brother. I'm glad you're enjoying your event tonight. You guys can see it's been going great all night long, and everybody's just vibing. So make sure next time you check out Afro Basil, you guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. How's it going? So this is Victor. They go by Victor Mode. I got invited here by a few artists, a few fashion, uh, fashion, uh, you know, fashion creative people. Yeah. So basically, they're tapped into the creative heartbeat of Houston. It's growing, and I'm glad to be a part of it, the uh, growing movement. So this is going to get some momentum. I want to see more of this. I see a little bit of everything here, so I'm loving it. Yeah. And what brought you to to Afrobasil tonight? Actually, a comedian, and uh, she. I actually missed her her set. I got Grace? here a little too late. Grace. Yes. Grace. Yes. Grace knows a lot of people. I met her before, and uh, she was at a fashion show with me. Yeah, so I we, model with Grace. Okay, there you go. Uh, so yeah, she invited me over. I connected with more people. This is what Houston was missing for a long time because we do a lot of vibing with, with a lot of, with the night scene. This is exactly what we need before we go to the night scene. That was the way we actually get to communicate and know some people. But what, what better way to move people through art, right? It shifts paradigms, it shifts subconscious, and that's how we tap into it. Yeah. Wow, that was uh, a beautiful uh, answer, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that. Thank you for saying that. Well, I, I, I suppose you have been enjoying yourself, and I hope you continue to enjoy your night. And thank you for being on Afro Vibes Radio. Thank you, thank you. Guys, you're still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio with Tequila. We have another lovely guest tonight. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Ashley. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. So how are you enjoying tonight's event? What brings you out? It's beautiful. I've never seen anything like this before. It's my first time. What are you looking forward to most tonight? Um, just the performances. Just seeing the new like artists in the city and everything. So how do you feel about being a part of an event that really um, highlights black culture and black art and music? It's amazing. Like I just I just feel like so supported in this environment. Like just so free. So it's beautiful. Well you look beautiful tonight. Thank you so much and I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. You guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Hi hello Nala, thank you for chilling with us on Afro Vibes Radio. How are you feeling about this entire night? So the night is very beautiful. I feel really ancient in here actually. Alright, I see you came out looking amazing. Is this about the heart? Like, show it off to the people. Cause show it off. <laughs> yes. What is this about? So I'm really connected to my roots and I like to show that I'm connected to my roots. And I'm also an artist here. So I just wanted to dress up. Well, thank you so much for chilling with us at Afro Vibes Radio. Can you wave to the camera? Vibes Radio, and we have somebody real special today, one of our favorite people here at the station, the African teddy bear himself. How are you doing, handsome? I'm good, I'm good. How you doing? What brings you out tonight? Um, I'm out here, my, my boy Ophelia, you know, he's an artist, so we're doing um, a little exhibition today, so I came out to support. You know, every time I go somewhere, I always see you at all the events. What makes you want to just dive into the culture so much? I mean, African culture is so live. I just want to like express it and get involved in it. So what can we expect from you? Because I know you just had your comedy show. What you got coming up that's next? 
Um, right now I got like private gigs, but I have, uh, I'm gonna be performing at Alibaba Live in Houston on September 28th. That's my next, um, I guess, stand-up performance in Houston. Good job, good job. Before you get out of here, tell them your social media so they can follow up and learn more about you. All right, that's O-T-Y-O-T-W-H-I-T-E. You guys heard it here first at Afrobyte. All right, hello, Gloria. What uh, brings you to Afrobyte tonight? What brings you tonight? Oh, just for the artwork and uh, some friends invited me. Okay, what were, were you, are you an artist tonight? No, I'm a, I'm a model. I just do uh, local modeling and fashion shows and All right, and what does it feel like to be at an event like this? It's actually dope. This is nice. This is my first time coming to the Afro Basel. Well, actually, this is my second time I came to the first one, and then this one, and it's really dope. And, like, this is more, like, more than I expected. Well, is there anything you're looking forward to happening later in the evening with the event? I don't know, just to meet more of the artists that has uh, some of the paintings, because this is great. Like, all the painting today is really amazing. Yeah, amazing art. All right, well, thank you for being on Afrobyte Radio. Thank you for being on Afro Basil, and I hope you continue to enjoy your night. Hey guys, you're here with Tequila Lewis at Afro Vibes Radio Houston, and we have the lovely performer and artist, Miss Skyra Bliss. How are you doing this evening? I'm doing lovely. I'm so, so, so excited to perform tonight. Absolutely. You look so beautiful as always with the signature purple hair. So tell us a little bit about what you're going to be doing tonight at Afro Basil. Tonight I will be performing three of my singles that are out. Um, the first one will be I, I, Eyes, a little slower, sexy, kind of get everybody in the mood. Next one is Next Him for all my ladies that's over man cheating and not treating us right. Okay. <laughs> and the last one is Natural and I love this song. I have a personal connection with it because it's just a celebratory song about black women and how we should just stand together and love each other love each other a little bit more so no one can break us down. Absolutely and how do you feel being here at Afro Basil because it's such an eccentric event but it celebrates black and African culture. I love it. I wish I knew where my roots were <laughs> so I can be like I'm this and I'm that but honestly it's just great to be in an environment where you're celebrated just for being yourself and I feel comfortable here so I'm really excited. Absolutely. Well, we can't wait to see you tonight. I know you're going to do great. I love everything that you do so far. Before you get out of here, give them your social media and let them know how they can actually stream your music. Awesome. My social media is Sky, at Skyra Bliss, and that's S-K-Y-R-A-H. B-L-I-S-S. -S. Facebook is Skyra Bliss Music. You can find all of my music streaming on all music platforms, which is Tidal, Apple Music, etc., Spotify. So, thank you. Thank you. You guys heard it here first with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Hey guys, we have another one of the lovely guests tonight at Afro Basil, located at Playhouse. How are you doing tonight? I'm great. How are you? Amazing. So what brings you out? I'm here tonight with Wear Models. I do fashion modeling and poetry, so tonight we're all here together to show y'all a little something, something. Amazing. So what have you loved the most about tonight? Wow. I love the upstairs unit. It's so spacious, and the art tonight is very different from the first night I came, so I'm excited. Amazing. Well, thank you so much. I hope you have the remainder of a great night. You look beautiful, and I love your entire style and outfit. You guys are still tuned in with Afro Vibes. Hey guys, so we're still tuned in with Afro Basil. The night is finally winding down. It's been such a great and lovely event. And we have another one of the co-founders, Mr. Davinier and Handsome Tosin. How are you doing tonight? I'm doing wonderful, Tequila. Thank you so much for coming out. You know, we love Afro Vibes Radio. Thank you so much for coming out to Afro Basil Chapter 4. Amazing turnout, black people, black creatives, beautiful people. You know, we love the vibes, man. We love the vibes. Did tonight go as planned? Did everything be successful? Oh, and what was the best part? Oh man, the performances. Every, we just love seeing black creatives showcase their talent, man. All the performances, the ballet dancer, live music, all the painters, artists, everything was lovely. Yeah. Can we expect more from Afro Basil coming up soon? Yeah. Oh yeah, once a month, September 18th. September 18th, you know, every third, every last Wednesday we out here. Afro Basil, chapter five, September 18th. You guys heard it right here at Afro Basil, located at Playhouse, Texas, with Afro Vibes. Really, um, what brings you to Afro Basil tonight? Um, I'm an artist tonight. Um, I'm doing, all my work is featured here tonight. And um, Afro Basil is a very unique um, event. They've been pushing um, up and coming artists, and I said I had to be part of it this time. Wow, 
and how do you feel about being a part of something like this? It's big because um, as a brand of mine, I've been doing art exhibitions, but this one is different and it's able to accommodate more artists, so I love it. What have you what have you been looking up to that has been fulfilled tonight? Pretty much the promotion team is very strong in Afro Basil and that way you get a lot of people looking at your work that don't know you and they will never see you. So every month I want to support as much as I can. That's amazing. Well, I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you so much. Please support my coloring book, Kelly Girls Coloring Book. It's a coloring book that represents our people. You brought it. I know. It's so far now. <laughs> so please check me out, affiliated.com. All my stuff is there. Hey, how you doing tonight? What's your name? I'm doing great. My name is Nadia. Good. So we're down here at Playhouse for Afro Basil. What do you think about the atmosphere so far? I really love it. I love seeing our people come together for something really good. And I really enjoy it. Like, What's the best part about Afro Basil? I love the art and the dancing. I love it. Do you feel like this is something that can really help unify the culture? I know it's millennials. A lot of people have been coming back to this Afro Basil event. It's just been getting better. Do you feel like it's helping connect everybody amongst the African diaspora? Oh, yes, definitely. I love seeing like the different art, and I'm meeting different artists. It's really cool. Absolutely. Well, give us your social media before you get out of here. Um, Kai Kuro on Twitter and Instagram. You guys heard it here first with Afro Vibes Radio Houston. Seven moves on. I'm on Afro Vibes Radio. I got, that's right, Houston's hottest female DJ, hottest in every aspect, face, body, skill set. Omu, I know the event went well, so I don't want to ask you any questions. I just want to know, are you single? I'm double. I told you I'm double. Omu's double. She's already taken. But on a realist, what do you think about Afro Bezu? Um, the energy was expected. You, you told me how it was going to be, and it was just that and even more. I enjoyed the art, the music, the performances, just the creativity involved. That's right. So as a DJ, what do you think you're going to bring for the next Afro Basil? Um, I think I brought, brought it here tonight, and I'm going to bring the same thing again. You know, we started off creating vibes, and it just slowly picked up from there. More people came in, and the energy just started to blossom, and it was a beautiful night. And all those DJ haters, yes, that won't let you shine, what are you going to say to them, Omu? It's your time. It's your time, Omu. A hater can't stop me, you know. A hater can't stop her. I do me, and, and God got me. So. That's right, she does her, and God got her. That's Omu for you. DJ O to the M to the U on Afro Vice Radio. Smashed out Afro Basil. That's right. And again, she's double. She's not single. She's double taken. So is that two guys or, you know, oh. two girls? No. no. Detail. <laughs> and make sure you book her. But don't book her on last Wednesdays of the month. She's at Afro Basil. And, 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 and my birthday is September 18th, the next one. Afro Bay. Yo, it's going to be mad lit. Whoa. That's right, Omu, we're going to be drinking. What do you drink, Hennessy? Is, is hey, guys, we're here with Afro Vibes Radio, and we are here with Tobe. Please tell us a little bit about what you do. Um, so personally, I am a storyteller and designer. Uh, I use different mediums such as photography, cinematography, graphic design, any type of design. I work through all sorts of mediums. Me, Tosin, and Heaven created this space for people like us to get together and have the opportunity to meet other creatives as well as network and hopefully work together to you know, build on different projects and build on this whole idea of bringing black people together, the whole diaspora, whether you're from Africa, whether you're born here, you're African American, we're all the same people. So just bring everybody together and go back to uh, you know where we came from, our strength, our power. Thank you so much. What's your social media? You can follow me at C O B E M O K O L O. Toby Makolo. Appreciate y'all. All right, hello, Grassy. How are you tonight? I'm great. How are you? Good. How? What have you been doing tonight? I've been looking at wonderful art, listening to wonderful music and performances. Feel to be out in it at this event. It feels great. Um, this is my first time coming to something like this, so I'm happy to be here. Have your expectations been met? Definitely, and I love how um, they did a little fashion show in the middle of it. It was nice. Yeah. Well, what do you look for?
forward to after Afro Basil or by the end of tonight? What do you what do you expect to happen? What do you hope to happen? Well, um, I made a couple connections, so you know I hope that everything keeps going from there and uh, networking and meeting great people. Okay. Well, thank you for being here. Thank you for being on Afro Vibes Radio, and we hope to see you next time at Afro Basil. Hi, my name is Kendall Joseph. Uche. Uche, you look pretty familiar. Where are you from? I'm from Houston. I'm from Nigeria. <laughs> Uche is also going to be uh, from, from, uh, from collab collaborating yeah, with yeah. Afro Vibes Radio. Uh, Afro Vibes. Yeah. All right. And what brings y'all to Afro Vibes or Afro Basil? Man, Afro Basil is a great event. Hosted by Tosin, shout out Tosin, shout out Playhouse, shout out Afro Vibes Radio, shout out Uche. It just brings together the best artists and creatives in Houston, what can I say? My homie is Toby, so I came through. Just to support, just to support. And he needed to borrow something, so. Yeah. Okay, well those are both very great reasons. <laughs> um, <laughs> how are you enjoying everything so far? And what do you look forward to for the rest of the night? What? Well, I bought a piece of art, so I enjoyed that. So not not a full painting, like a print. It was ten dollars. So. <laughs> uh, man, like I said, the performances were great. I really enjoyed the fashion show and the opportunity to network with some of the best people in Houston, who I admire from afar. But now I get to meet them here. Great! I'm glad you have beautiful reasons to be here. Well, I hope you enjoy everything else. And thank you for being on Afro Vibes Radio at Afro Basil. Thank you. Shout out Philip from Afro Vibes. And you're tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio, located at Playhouse. And we have some art here that is obviously moving and grooving. Tell us about what you got going on right now. All right, my name is Truly, Truly Versatile. And basically what I become is a human mannequin. I become the art. Like, and this piece is about the fashion industry. It's about the redundancy, the repetitiveness. It's about working with you got. It's, it's all about how we are as human beings and how repetitive we can be. But it's also about owning it at the same time. Okay, now it looks like you got some fanny packs going on here. What was the inspiration behind this look? Fanny packs came back hard. Like they came back, like nobody was wearing them and then they just automatically came back out of nowhere. And it was just my inspiration to see how like things come back around all the time. It's like, and that's what my book is on. So what's your social media account so people can learn more about you and kind of get into the groove of your fashion and your style? All right, so I'm a photographer. I'm a performing artist. My social media is truly versatile. So it's C-R-U-L-E-I-V-E-R-F-A-C-I-L-E. -E -E. And definitely check me out. I got a website and everything. Amazing. Well, you heard it right here. Make sure you guys follow her and tune in to Afro Vibes Radio. You guys are tuned in with Afro Vibes Radio. And we have another lovely guest tonight. How are you doing? I'm good. Good. So what brings you out to Afro Basil? Um, I just wanted to enjoy the art and the you know performances, you know, just an eclectic view of the vibes from Africa. So. What do you like the most about Afro Basil? Say that again. I said what do you like the most about Afro Basil? Afro Basil, I love the fact that they include all types of art, not just you know paintings, but like dance, um, fashion, so just all around a variety. I love it. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for telling us about your experience. To learn more, keep on tuning in with Afro Vibes Radio Houston.